Today we are going to discuss about another experiment. The aim of the experiment is to construct the logic gates AND, OR, NOT and to verify this truth table. To do the experiment we need the apparatus, breadboard, diode, resistance, cell and voltmeter. Now we are going to familiarize the breadboard. It have four compartments 1, 2, 3 and 4. In this the connection is horizontal in the first compartment. Up from here to here they are connecting points. Similarly from here to here these are connecting points. Remember that there will be no vertical connection. Similarly, from here to here, the connection points are possible and here also connections are possible. But in the case of second, the connection points are vertical. These fives are connection points. But this and this are not connecting points. Remember, similarly, in the third compartment also, the vertical five points are connected but the horizontal there will be no connections. Similarly in the case of fourth compartment the horizontal connections are possible from here to here. They can be connected as together a single connections. You are familiar with this PN junction diode. This is positive side and this will be the negative side. The negative side is indicated by a silver mark or silver ring. Another component is resistance. It have marked its value in the form of a ring as shown in the figure. There will be no positive and negative ends so you can connect as it is. The practical diagram for OR gate is as shown in the figure. D1 is one diode and D2 is another diode. The negative terminal of the diodes are connected together as shown. A resistance of suitable value is connected as shown in figure. A and B are the input terminal of the diode D1 and D2. In the figure C and D are the positive terminal of the battery and negative terminal of the battery. You consider the positive as 1 and negative as 0. We can form the connection of the OR gate as shown in the figure. D1, D2, they are connected together. A resistance is connected from here to the negative terminal of the battery. The output is taken from here and here using a voltmeter. You can take reading from this voltmeter as output. This is the input terminal of D1 and this is the input terminal of diode D2. Now we can consider the different input possibilities in the OR gates. Dear friends, now we are going to the observation part of the experiment. We have to verify the truth table of OR gate. 0, 0 will be the input. We expect the output also 0. We can verify it.
zero input of the b also zero now look the voltmeter that also zero that means the first row of the two table is true the second observation is a equal to zero b equal to six we can do a equal to zero b equal to six we expect the output plus six now it can be verified from the voltmeter it also six sub observation is a equal to six b equal to zero we expect the output six we can verify a equal to six b equal to zero the output should be six it can be observed from the voltmeter the fourth observation is a equal to six b equal to six we expect the output as six it also we can verify a equal to six b equal to six the output is six it can be observed in the voltmeter the next gate to verify is and gate in this you have to careful about the connection look here the diodes are reversed and a second cell is connected as shown in the figure the output is taken across from here and here dear friends look the circuit of the anti gate d1 d2 and the resistance these are the input terminals output is taken from this point in the voltmeter the observation part for the and gate is a equal to 0 b equal to 0 we expect output 0 it can be observed in the voltmeter a equal to 0 b equal to 0 the observed voltmeter reading is also zero next a equal to 0 b equal to 6 output is zero a equal to 0 b equal to 6 output is zero in the voltmeter